Welcome everyone, Farmer Cop here. This is going to be a new mod map tour of Avon Valley. This is by Missy B and Volcan95. This is 42.86 megabytes to download for all platforms. So uh, the description, as always, we're going to start off reading that. It says, "Welcome to Avon Valley. This is empty wilderness. This is empty wilderness. Is set in the UK. Probably a little bit of a translation issue there or something." Uh, but this is empty wilderness in the UK, is what I'll say. Uh, build your own farm and turn this great expanse back to its former glory. There is a custom-made pond that is great to relax by at the end of the day. The following are available on the map. Three selling points for bales, liquids, and crops products from the base game. A custom-built BGA with selling point for methane. Small forest that can be used for startup. Custom-built UK geo and one predefined grass field to get you started. So this is kind of like, it's like a UK no man's land, maybe, is how I describe it. This is where we, ooh, that was a little bit glitchy there. Start off here in new farmer mode, right where we're at now. I'm going to fast forward time just a little bit so we can see a little bit clearer in terms of everything. Ooh, about to start raining on us. Let's not have that happen. But yeah, this is where we start off. Let's go ahead and hop in the menu here. This is the map. We're down here. This is the map. Everything's packed down there. Yeah. Are we on a tractor? Is that where this was behind us? Looks like it. Anyhow, yeah. Chunks of land. Very no man's land esque. Um, yeah, very no man's land esque. But uh, yeah, so you start off owning this chunk here and this chunk up here. And you can buy that little chunk. I don't know why we don't own that one, but that's like kind of forestry up there, it looks like. And maybe this is the grass field they're talking about. Since everything out here looks like grass. Well, it's not going to show up as grass at least, but that's okay. Uh, yeah, so an interesting concept for map. I think this has a lot of potential for people that like to start out uh, building stuff up. I'll, now, the big question I have, and we'll see as we, and I'm looking, it doesn't look like it's going to be very promising, is there's not really any trees out here. So it's really kind of like, it's like kind of more of a, like a flatlands. I don't know. It's kind of, I don't know. It doesn't seem, it seems like I feel like it would really use some good trees out here. I think would be good for it. We're just going to do a flyover because that's about all we can do with this. Um, we could drive on it, but it doesn't really make sense. Yes, yeah, so you got this little pond here, which is just nice. I like this. A lot of good detail down here. I wish there's more detail through the rest of the map, I think. The train is kind of interesting. I do like that it's kind of hilly. It's not just flat out flat. Um, you have your forestry little area up here where you can do some forestry to make some money. But uh, yeah, this is an interesting map for sure. Um, I think I think I would like to see more detail on it, to be honest. I know that it kind of gives you the ability to customize it however you want, but I think I would like to see more of that. Maybe, ooh, I'm getting, ooh, that was a lot of lag right in this area here. Uh, but, ooh, that is a lot. Wow. Uh, but I would like to see, I think, more trees in the map. It just kind of feels really, really naked, I think, is how I describe it. But, yeah, I think other than that, I think a really good concept for a map. I like that part about it. Um, down here we have, if we zoom in down here and focus on this, we have the lime production and biogas plant here, which um, let's actually just go through here because we haven't even done that yet. Um, custom geo, so you can see everything is kind of moved around, shifted around a little bit down through there. No extra crops or anything like that. Um, we don't need to go through the, the cell points in here because there's only a couple. Um, we do have quite a bit of sturdy equipment actually for this map, which we'll take a look at in the store. Start off with $100,000 in new farmer mode, no animal pens, no contracts because there's no fields, and you don't own any of the production changes is one thing I was curious about and no collectibles on the map. So if we take a look at the starting equipment, we might as well do that real quick. Start off with a Massey Ferguson um, MF3670. We also have a Fent 942 Vario. We have a New Holland CH770 Harvester. We also have a Kloss Scorpion uh, 1033 Telehandler. We also have a Kloss Carrot 140 TD Trailer. We have a header for our CH770 from New Holland. Large plow, um, decent sized cultivator as well. Uh, Power Harrow, um, a cedar set up there with the extra tank. Um, sprayer for uh, your liquid fertilizer and herbicide. Then we also have a um, solid fertilizer spreader. We have a tree planter, which is kind of nice. I like that. And we have a bucket for our telehandler. So there you go. That's our starting equipment, and it's all parked right here in the store. There's, this is, I don't know if it's my computer or what the issue is, but there we go. It seems that now that it's kind of loaded it in a little bit, um, it's having less issues. But yeah, everything is packed down here in this corner. We have the shop, the repair trigger, um, and then if we go into the menu here, um, we've got grain selling, we have our animal dealer, animal dealer sell point, um, we have the grain liquid sell point, and we have gas station. It's all packed right in here. Um, and then you have this whole expanse to explore. You can see there's some differently, some interesting stuff around. And I think the border could maybe use 
maybe something out there. I don't know. Pretty out. There you guys go. That is uh, Avon Valley. That's really all I have for you in terms of Avon Valley. So there you go. If you guys enjoyed this video, drop a like down below. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button up on the screen to join the Farmer Cop channel and turn on your notification bell so you don't miss any future videos I may post. This has been Farmer Cop. Thank you guys for coming and for watching.